Welcome back. Medical research is very clear that some of the most significant health risks we face are associated with being overweight. Even with diet and exercise, sometimes a more drastic option could be the best choice. In this week's Medical Center Health Systems Taking Care of You, we're talking about bariatric surgery. Dr. Artun Aksade is a surgeon at MCH. He is our guest today. Thank you so much for being here with us. Thank you. I guess let's start with who qualifies for bariatric surgery? Who's the ideal candidate for this? Well, um, as a medical center hospital, we're a center of excellence and we, we always go by National Institute of Health criteria, mm -hmm. which is uh, somebody with a body mass index of over 40, which in turn turns out about, about 100 pounds overweight, depending on your height, it's around there. Or if you have a medical, a medical condition associated with obesity, which is mainly diabetes, high blood pressure, sleep apnea, um, metabolic syndrome, or some females have polycystic ovarian syndrome. If, if your BMI is at 35 or above, you would qualify also. So that's about, about 60 pounds over your ideal body weight. Every patient has to be looked at individually. So what's the preparation like for bariatric surgery? Preparation for bariatric surgery is a education period where we with the uh, patients uh, discuss their health, discuss their um, lifestyle, and we actually have a dietitian that actually teaches them how to eat uh, better, how mm -hmm. to make better food choices, what to expect after surgery, because this is a life-changing procedure, obviously for the better, because a lot of these medical conditions that's caused by obesity is actually uh, reversed or cured in a very high percentage rate. Yeah. We talk about diabetes being able to be cured about 80% of the time, wow. high blood pressure the same way, sleep apnea can be cured more than 90% of the time, reflux can be cured, polycystic ovarian syndrome, especially for young ladies who are not able to conceive because of that, gastric bypass actually cures it at 100%. So this is not like your gallbladder surgery, you have the surgery and you go home and, and done, in right? a month you'll be back to normal. This takes about uh, education pre-op and post-op. We have support groups uh, for that and obviously uh, you are a patient for life. The last question I have for you is how safe is, is the surgery? And I love the way you kind of put this in perspective for us. Well, safety is uh, very important obviously. You know, any p kind of procedure that we actually perform it has to be effective, but it has to be also safe. Mm -hmm. In a center of excellence like Medical Center Hospital, this surgery is actually safer than having your appendix taken out. It's actually safer than having a C-section. This is a different era because we do laparoscopic and bar robotic bariatric surgery. Now, 50, 10, 15 years ago, most of these procedures were done open, so they had a lot of p complications because of the open incision. People go home in one to two days. They don't have post-op complications and they do well as long as they follow recommendations. It's a fascinating topic. Thank you so much for being here with us today. And we'll be discussing with a patient next week about the after, what happens after the surgery. So we appreciate your time. Thanks for being with us today. You're